What's up, you guys? Welcome. We're here at Downtown Disney, World of Disney, more importantly, yet again. Why, Katie? Because we are going to show you all the magic of the newly reimagined World of Disney store in Downtown Disney. That's right. There's a ton of special effects, including what's behind us right here. All these windows, lots of projections, lots of nods to all the animation, which is what built Disney. So we're going to go check all that stuff out right now. Let's go. The windows are the first thing you see when you walk up. And make sure you check all the windows. This is just one of them where they have a permanent outline and then they project animation. See, there's the permanent outline. This window features Cinderella. You can see the outline and it's a drawing pad, which is kind of cool. Princess and the Frog represented over there. Looks like the animation is not on for Cinderella right now. I don't think there is animation on Cinderella. Maybe that one's just a static, but I feel like there is, but... The Princess and the Frog does. It's on the other side? Well, you can see it from here, too. Oh, you're just talking about the screen. Yeah, it like, it animates, kind of, like, colors. See? And yeah. then over here... You got the drawing table over here. All the princesses and everything. And then look at Belle's back there on a sketch pad, too. Right, let's check out this other window. Yeah. There's a few blank windows here that I'm sure at some point yeah. we'll probably get some sort of adornment. Oh, yeah. Because it looks like they're deeper, and these are just doors that are open, you know, closed. Yeah that will open because look, oh, this is the best window display in the whole park. Yeah, look at this, you look guys. Look at the firework and the castle. Wow. Oh my goodness. These are magical see. drawing pads. These are enchanted windows. Oh my goodness. Wow. This is like the window that's all about the park. See how it's drawing the hitchhiking ghost, yeah. the tram, and then it'll do the, uh, it'll do the train. Nice Pirates of the Caribbean. Wow. And look at the giant paintbrush, giant pencil. Wow. Because this is a giant drawing table, so you need you need big implements for that. Ready for the best ever? Oh, look at the small there world. There she is. Oh, and it animates too. Isn't it gorgeous? Wow. It's the most perfect window display. If there ever was one, that's it. And then, oh yeah, there's merch to be sold. Oh yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's I would say that that's the first magic you see when you come in. Both sides have some sort of light up little sign. You want to know what's really magic though? Is the fact that there's a giant pretzel, a giant goldwood squirrel that we can't even get here in California, and then there's giant churros with glitter on them up there. That's magic. More signage. Adventure is out there. So look at this awesome projection, you guys, on the floor. And it's animated projection. It's not just projection. Look at that. You see the monorail going around? Yeah, the monorail's going around. There's the trolley. You can stare at this for a long time. I know, right? Can yeah. You just, like, sit here? And then from here, you look up and you see an unbelievably animated castle. Wow. That's so pretty. Little sunset, and then oh, what comes after sunset? Fireworks! Boom! I bet you that's Remember Dreams Come True right there. Yeah, that's what that is. It kind of looks like the 60s. I would, how did I know you were gonna say it looks like the 60s? Disneyland Forever is the best. That's one of the coolest elements in here, but I'm sure there's more. Let's go check it out. Okay, we're searching out more magic. Look, these are all flat files, Katie. Oh whoa, I didn't even realize. These are all that. flat files oh, to store all your artwork. Fox in the house. Sword in the Stone, Oliver, I love that movie. Oh, the Rescuers, we were just talking about that. Let's check the artwork for that. Oh, oh. oh, they're locked. Jungle Book, Beauty and the Beast, Little Mermaid. Hey, do you think that they go in order? It's a nice desk too. I would like that desk. Okay, now look down here on all of the cash wrap. It's different all now, over. Now, you know what this reminds me of? The Tam O'Shanter, where yes. the animators used to go to lunch because they didn't have a commissary and they actually did this. They carved some images into the table that is the Disney table yeah. that you can go check out. One of the images being from... The dinosaurs from the, the dinosaurs. primeval world. Yeah. Check that out and they're everywhere too, like... Well then, you look up and you got these awesome animated screens here. And they change. There's Fantasia over there, Clint. Wow. Switching to Peter Pan, that is so yeah, cool. That's awesome. Oh, that one just changed to Snow White. And this one over here just changed to Snow White. 
Interesting old poster. I wonder if that was a real one. There's a symphony one. That one's been changed too. Right on down there. I love the boards in the back with all the ideas. That's cool. So I know it reads kind of weird on camera, but these little drawing boards animate as well. Wow, look at that, that is so cool. I seriously walked by, I had no idea that these, that those actually moved. That is some crazy magic. And those are located all around, so you gotta keep your eyes open. More light box representation here. And of course, the princesses that, I would say, the Fab Five princesses. Is that not the cutest thing you've ever seen? That is awesome. I love that scene too, when he gets his kiss. Yeah. Okay, searching for more magic. As we enter the Christmas area, which you can see a whole vlog on that, we'll put that up in the uh, upper corner for you. And look down here, they even have a nice projection, oh, shadow. We have a nice projection for the holidays. Look at that. The world of Disney. Amazing, huge <laughs> projection on the wall behind the holiday stuff. That is cool. And of course, there's the cameras up there that are doing it, the projectors. And our buddy from Small World is there to greet you as a giant ornament. Now, I would almost call this magic because when you see this much Star Wars, it's magic. Now, you know what's cool is I actually have that exact artwork <laughs> in our live Disney office. What a trip. I'm not sure if this qualifies as magic either, but the lamp, the Luxo lamp, Pixar. It's too bad that doesn't move around and light up. That would be kind of cool. There's some cuddly neon for the plush area. And over in the far corner, We've got the Mickey Mouse Club merch and their own projection. So I'm assuming that these projections can be switched out depending on what they're selling here. So that's kind of cool. Look at that. And then there's all the Mickey Mouse Club merch that you can purchase with an animated Mickey hat. And it's playing the Mickey Mouse Club intro opening titles, which are ingrained in my head as well as I'm sure yours. That's a really great piece of magic here. One of my favorites at the new reimagined World of Disney. And directly to the left and behind the animated Mickey Ears hat are some Mickey balloons. That'd be cool if they sold those. And then on the opposing opposite side, Mouse, also in balloons. Mickey, Mouse, this is his whole area. Awesome. Oh my gosh, what is that's what I'm telling you. Isn't that cool? That's, That's what I thought it was originally, but then... Or no, it's just magic going in and out. And then we land over here. And then it paints all the... One of the cooler representations of magic here at World of Disney. That was awesome. All right, you guys. Well, we hope you enjoyed the magic of World of Disney, and we suggest that you come here and search it out and find it and, and explore, uh, not only for the shopping, but for all the cool special effect details that are here at World of Disney. Yeah, they sure did an amazing job here. So if you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Yep. Turn on your bell notification so you know when we upload our videos oh, yeah. and when we go live here from Disneyland. And if you'd like to support Life Disney, you can actually become one of our Patreon members. We will link all that information in the description below. That's right, and we will see you next time on Life Disney and Beyond. Bye-bye, okay. everybody! Thank you.